hello guys real quick gonna do a quick um showing of the small haul that i purchased from walmart it's mostly pen and gear products but there are a couple of other products as well so let's go ahead and get with this so here we have a budget planner 80 pages and we have the yearly overview. And again, I really don't know how much this was. I want to say it was maybe 288. I want to say this was maybe 288. Typically, the prices of these journals and things are 288. So, I don't know. But anyway, so that just keep, you know, and then it changes colors, I guess, with the month. So, yes, cool little budget planner here. There is the ISBN number if you would like to scan that to see if they have them available in your store. Next, we have a travel planner. This is 80 pages as well. There again is the ISBN number if you want to grab this. And uh, do I travel a lot? No. But at the same time, this is still something cool to have for when you do travel. And here, this is so cool. It has state, city, and date. You can also mark it off. And then it has over here for um, other countries. So yeah i like this look at that it has a packing list here pre-trip checklist a savings tracker yeah like your goal how much you need to save per month notes if need be and then the monies that you save and then here the world is a book and those who do not travel uh read only one page i love that i love that that is a great quote uh, trip plans, 60 day countdown to do's. Ooh, this is nice, y'all. Uh, itinerary, your week at a glance, road trip, flight details. Okay, getting around like rental car stuff, bus transfer stuff, other things, accommodations, things to do, your activities, trip bucket list outfit oh lord they got an outfit planner y'all that is crazy you have your daytime clothing gear your evening clothing gear daily journal memories oh you can write down stuff and they have more so they, i'm sure they probably have what a couple days worth here we have expense tracker your trip duration total budget activities miscellaneous and then it starts again so it's enough for what uh maybe three right yeah i'll say it's three because it start over again maybe four no three yeah it's got enough for three trips so basically depending on how many big trips you take a year it could be good for a year you know, people normally take about, what, one to two big trips a year, maybe. I picked up a couple of these guys. Um, I wanted this kind. Now, see, you see how this is? This is super thick. This, is, this has all of my EC stickers in it. Well, not all of them, but majority of my EC stickers. So I needed to get a couple of more so I can break this down and have you know stickers um in uh more places so this don't look the way it does right so but i didn't see any more of the colored ones the designer ones so i just got one of each of these which is what they had on on hand and these were four dollars and 36 cents a piece which is the typical price for those which sucks but i mean I guess it is what it is that, you know, $5 is not bad, but still, you wouldn't think that it would be that price, you know what I mean? Um, 
I think this is a sticker book that I don't have. So I saw some of the other sticker books there, but I already had those. So I did not pick up another one because I already have them. So uh, they also had washi, but I don't need washi. So I didn't get any washi. Um, but let's do a flip through of this sticker book. Now, the sticker book was $2.88 as well. So let's do a flip so you all can see what's in here. I do apologize. My allergies have been giving me a fit lately and I've been taking my allergy medicine, but y'all know how it is. I might have to switch it up and start taking another medication. This one might not be working as well as it should now. Ooh, that's kind of damaged. Look at those, the gold ones. I love these little tiny stickers. These would be great for the task cards. So yeah, I might use some of those and make some more task cards. So that's the sticker book. And this should go pretty quickly now. So here we have the notepad set. If y'all have seen in previous uh, videos, um, I have like maybe four of these but um uh, yeah i think these are pretty cool um is this broken anyway so here it has the checklist it has and these are not sticky by the way they are just um you know you rip them off or whatnot and it comes with the pen the pens are actually pretty decent the pens in these are pretty decent but this was $2.08 for this. Not bad. And these I thought were super cool. These are tearaways, okay? They're not sticky, as you see. You just like rip them off. So it's a planner pad. Let me open this, that way you can see. And I don't know. How much these were so where do you rip them right here I thought this probably opens up but I guess not but I assume I don't feel any preparation though I assume you would just use this as a guide and just rip it off because there's no preparation there. Normally you can feel like a preparation to, you know, to allow you to rip, but there is none here. Let me see. Maybe there is, cause you see that line going across right there. I don't know if y'all can see it. There is a line going across here. Maybe there is a preparation. Anyhow, it's just a, a pad and there are I don't say how many pages i thought oh yeah 120 so there's 120 sheets right something that you could just sit on your desk and see you have date important times must accomplish top three things your check off list your wellness tracker your um a uh, task tracker of like drinking your water notes and your affirmation this is super cool like i thought i know it's something simple but i thought it was really cool and i wanted and i picked this up but let's see. i do not see I don't know what they have this listed as because I don't see what it is. It says planner pad. Maybe it was two eighty eight. So yeah, it's a planner pad. So this was two eighty eight. These two are two eighty eight. 
So here is another one. It says, I've got this. It's a planner pad. It has Sunday through, I mean, Sunday through Saturday here and then just lines. So I'll pull this down so you can see that past the emblem. So you have the date here, Sunday through Saturday, and then just line paper. So yeah, that's 120 sheets for that as well. Then I picked up two of these guys. I'm missing something here. I'm missing something. It must be in the other in the other bag. Let me go check. Be right back. Okay, so I picked up a couple of these guys. I really like these five subject notebooks. As you see, there's 150 sheets, college ruled micro perforated five repositional dividers now i have a black one these are other two colors they had these are tiny so these are sorry i'm out of breath i had to run upstairs 6.75 inches by 8.26 inches that's how big these are and what i did not note in the other video is these guys well, it said it's reposit. There it is. But all of them are not ripping. <laughs> but so, yeah, you can literally take these off and move them. But they are five subject notebooks. And that's cool. Each of these uh, dividers are different colors. You can put your own little... Uh, page flags or whatnot you're um on here to denote what they what each section is for so yeah that i wanted i wanted to pick some of these up so i grabbed two of these again i have the black one so i picked up the pink and the blue and it looks like no the colors are different for the dividers but yeah i thought these were super cool i like these this is what I had to run upstairs to get. And though the five subject notebooks, did I say how much they were? They were $2.97. These page markers are also, no, these are $144. So there's six page markers in here. They are magnetic. And um, again, pen and gear. They're small. But yes, I really like these types of page markers. Um, I was thinking of using some die cuts possibly to make some page markers as well, but we shall see. So yeah, picked up these guys, 144. Last but not least, I purchased a calligraphy book. This by far is the most expensive. Um, I did have a planner, but I ended up putting that back because I have more than enough planner. That planner was kind of cool. It was a two year planner started in june and went to june of 2023 so anyway i ended up putting that one back um but anyway picked up this guy and because like i said i've never done calligraphy or whatnot but i've always wanted to try it and this book was eight dollars and 79 cents so it says it's calligraphy made easy and I do have um a pen that I had gotten as a freebie when I purchased my um Hobonichi the Hobonichi Techo so in that video it came with a calligraphy pen so this gives you you know little rules and <coughs> excuse me guys <laughs> tips on how to use the calligraphy pen and then it has like here you have warm-up drills so each line you do what it tell you to do here there's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen thirteen lines here and this has eleven things for you to do so and then we have more warm-up drills more warm-up drills and then we have what they call minuscules so I guess here you need to practice 
uh, the lettering. So you practice the lettering. It gives you a line to do so. And it goes through the whole alphabet. And then you're going through the alphabet again, but I think this time it's in uppercase, it's uppercase letters. Then we have numbers. Then we have whatever this is called, developing alternates, connecting the letters, and then practice connections, practice words, flourishes, whatever that is. Then we go into troubleshooting, compositions, and then we have 30 projects. So it goes into that. Now we have some colored sheets here. I guess it's wanting you to write, to copy what this is on the, on the opposite page. So it gives you different projects and you have more blank sheets for you to practice on. And then you have blank blank sheets in the back. The paper is kind of thick. It's thicker than, you know, regular paper. As you see, you can't see through it. You see my hand, you can't, you can't see through it. So it should work well with the calligraphy pen, but yeah picked up an, an, a calligraphy book because I've been wanting to learn calligraphy so that's it for this haul guys again it's a small haul but y'all know I'm long-winded when I do my videos so uh and I apologize for that but that's just who I am <laughs> and um so yeah that'll be it for this video guys thank you all for watching and we will see you on the next video take care guys